Hello, I'm Anish Shah, a PhD student at Rensselaer Polytechnic Institute. I'll be talking about our paper on position masking for improved layout aware document understanding. I did this work uh, last summer as an intern in IBM Research. So our goal is to extract key information from visually rich documents. So these documents are used everywhere in businesses and in our daily life. Some examples are invoices, purchase orders, receipts, etc. To understand these documents, we need to look at both the text and the layout of this page. So there is no single format for these uh, visually rich documents. The information can be presented in different ways like tables, forms, figures, etc. So it is not uh, easy to create custom rules for extracting information from these widely different formats. We can use machine learning to automate the information extraction task from these type of documents. Our work uh, builds on the layout LM model, which was an extension of BART. We know BART is a very successful model for uh, different language understanding tasks. So BART has uh, two stages of training, the pre-training stage and the fine tuning stage. So in both these stages, BART is trained to understand text. So it does not look at the position of a text, which is important for understanding these types of documents. This is the input to the BART model. So there is a token embedding, uh, 1D position embedding, which is the position of the word in the sequence and also a segment embedding. The segment embedding is just to distinguish between two different sentences in an input. We were not using uh, two sentences so this is not important for our use. Uh, so BART is trained using the masked language modeling loss where uh, some tokens are randomly chosen from a sentence and masked out. The task for the model is to predict those masked tokens. So this is great for understanding text as this uh, forces the model to understand the relationship between the words in a sentence. But for these visually rich documents, we also know the position of these words by having these bounding boxes where we have these XY coordinates of the corners of the box. So the layout LM model adds these coordinate embeddings in addition to the 1D positional embedding. And this simple step uh, helps the model to outperform state of the art on different uh, document recognition data sets. So in our model, we use the same uh, 1D and 2D position embeddings. And on top of that, we also add a position masking uh, loss function where we mask these 2D position embeddings as well as the words. So now the task for the model is to predict the token and the position at the same time. So we can do the position masking in different ways. One is one method is to mask all these different XY coordinates. Uh, another method would be 
to mask some of these positions so x1 position masking is masking just one x coordinate out of these four uh, now let's look at the experiments so similar to bar we have these two training stages pre-training and fine-tuning uh, for pre-training BART and layout LM both models use the mask language model loss for our model we add the position masking loss uh, for the pre-training data set we use 500,000 tobacco litigation documents uh, these are different types of documents like letters forms advertisements etc and there is no label for these documents for fine-tuning we are using the key value pair extraction task so given a document the task is to identify the keys and values for example in this document for the key date received the value is UNK so we model this problem as a token classification problem where each token is classified as key value header or other entity type so the data set is the fun sd data set it has 149 train documents and 50 test documents so this is a small data set now let's look at the results for position masking, these models were trained with both classification and regression loss. Uh, compared to the baseline layout LM model, we can see a performance improvement over 5% with the classification loss. So these results are uh, averaged over 5 runs with five different seeds and for pre-training all these models were trained on the same data set we can see that position masking with both losses for partial position masking with x1 and also full position masking outperformed the baseline uh, layout LA model and all of these results are statistically significant so you see that adding a position masking loss to the pre-training task improves the performance of layout LA model on form understanding by 5%. Next, uh, we'd like to understand the effect of adding this loss function on other tasks. Uh, we can also uh, combine this method with newer models like layout LM version 2 and text image layout transformer we can also explore additional pre-training tasks for visually rich document understanding uh, in this uh, paper we worked on extracting keys and values we can also try to uh, link the extracted keys and values next well, thank you for your time uh, let me know if you have any questions